Is everyone okay? Three of you? Hey Tucker, get over here. And don't ask questions. That was about this tall. Had really sharp teeth. Walked with a limp. That's about it. Any idea where it came from? His parents? Uh, monster Refuge, maybe? Had a tag on its ear. Hey, am I in trouble? Cause I was just, I was just doing my job. I'm not in any trouble. It's not like it was a bald eagle. If I don't envy you when the reporters show up, they'd be quite the celebrity. Like the Instinct album? Who are you? I helped with the camera. Whatever. She did a little bit after I stabbed it repeatedly. Well, they'll probably want to talk to you as well. Thank you so much. So, uh, you like music? Yeah, I listen to the radio. I don't really know what people are talking about when they say names of, like, bands and stuff. That's cool. So, where did you learn to hit like that? Oh, I play softball. You don't look like it. Oh. No offense. <laughs> oh, it's just like a city league co-ed team. I play with my friends. Oh, those guys? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I That's cool. Hey, man. What's up? I just killed a monster and got laughed at. What? Yeah. Are these your friends? They all look like the same human. Copy and paste it over and over. Except for that girl right there. Oh, that's Jane. She definitely looks like a Jane. Um, I forgot to introduce us. I'm Gerald. I'm Bethany. This is Tucker. Ugg boots, huh? Hey, can I talk to you for a second? <clears throat> so, what's going on, Gerald? I think she's my future girlfriend. You think she's your future girlfriend? Yeah. Really? Okay, I want you to look over at her and then look at yourself and tell me why what you just said is really stupid. Dude, we had a connection there. Oh, oh, sorry. Okay, so you had, you had a connection? Oh. What kind of connection was it? She touched my arm. Mmm. Well, remind me to stop doing that. Uh, because although we're good friends, I don't want to go in that direction with you. But what I really think, Gerald, is that you just think she's hot. That's what I think. No, I don't. Oh, you don't? No. Oh, okay. Liplicious, maybe? 
What is this? I don't know. This just in, oh. Gerald Cromwell, a 22-year-old resident of Utah County, has killed a monster inside of a popular restaurant where he works, saving the lives of 37 people who were dining there. The monster had escaped from the National Monster Refuge, police say. Cromwell said of the heroic act, quote, I was just doing my job. Gerald Cromwell, we applaud you for saving so many lives, and also for having a job. And uh, what are some of your ambitions? I'd really like to start a gigapet incident. Well, I really want to be an actress. What is this? This is my, my roommate, the hero board. I'm not illiterate. I know. And it's because you're a hero. Dude, I just like these pictures, man. Like this one. You two look so cute right there. And this one, this pose on top of the car. That's priceless, that's a good pose. And um, this one, however. What is she doing there? Texting and driving? I heard you were attacked by a monster. Did the monster touch you in any way? I was attacked by monsters, but they weren't monsters, they were extraterrestrials. Those were those little greys that mutilate cows on farms. They're like the Kukachapas. They put their straw in me and sucked every drop of liquid out of me. Scary. Wow, what a scary situation. <laughs> You look like a good couple together, like peanut butter and jelly sandwiches, cheese on a hamburger. I think we make a great couple, too. We never thought we'd find love late at night in a diner, but I guess we proved that scary stories can have fairy tale endings. Fairy tale ending? Two tickets to Couple Town. I want to thank you for being on this segment of my show, telling me how monsters scared the living hell out of you. Don't let the bed bugs bite. Don't let the monsters suck you out of your life. Hello? Hello? Hey. What are you doing? I'm at softball practice in the Lions Field. Oh, can I come? The vlogger's doing a story on me. Oh, yeah, he can do a follow up story on us. How long till you be here? Seven minutes. Perfect. Bethany with her friends at the park. Oh yeah? I'm actually on the way to the softball fields play with them right now. Uh, well, then have fun. Bye. Alright, see you, man. This is Brian the Blogger. Hi. Hey, we're playing softball. Do you want to be up next to bat? Sure. Dude, watch this. Often? Just 
when people get hurt. Makes sense. Kind of remind me of Kanye West. Always rap people's injuries, <laughs> interrupting games. <laughs> I guess so. Oh my gosh, Gerald, are you okay? Yeah, um, I'll be fine, but I think I'm gonna go. Okay, um, is it okay if I come by later to help? Okay, it'll be fine. Thanks, Jane. You know what? I really like you. I know. Time. <sighs> Mine looks like a black John C. Riley. That's kind of mean. Remember how I told you I saw Bethany the other day? Mm hmm Well, what I didn't tell you right away, because I wanted to wait for the right moment, I thought now would be pretty good, uh, is that I saw her kissing some other guy. Where's your proof? Proof? Yeah. I, I, this, this is a picture of him actually. No, I don't have any proof. I just, I know what I saw. What, what are you doing? He was, look at that. Why would she write that? Look dude, I don't know. I'm just, I'm just trying to be a friend, man. I don't have any proof. I didn't bring my spy cam. I'm just, you know, we have history. I'm not, I'm not trying to break up this epic romance you think you've got going on. I'm just, I, I know it's... I think you're jealous. You think I'm jealous? Yeah. You, you think I'm jealous of, of what? Of her? Of you? Yeah, we Honestly. had a really good time last night. No, I'm not jealous. And I'm not jealous of your art, and I'm not jealous of your t-shirt either. This is my favorite shirt. Dude, whatever. Up. Hi, how are you? I'm all right. Good. How's your How's your knee? It's mediocre at best. Oh, I'm sorry. It's all good. Things happen. I wrote this song about a girl. Well, I saw your face And I knew you were the girl that I was to win I saw those wings and I knew them. You were the one that was to take me away How's it going, man? What are you guys doing here? I came to bring you your cell phone, which you left. Just trying to be a best friend. Hi. Hello. Hello. 
Um, my name is Tucker, uh, and I'm here to uh, play a song for you tonight. Hopefully it's a, a good song for some of you, and a really hurtful song for others. Um, here it goes, it's about a, a friend of mine who has some, uh, some lady issues. Um, yeah, here we are. Best friends getting played by a girl who wears fake tan on her legs in it. It looks pretty blotchy, by the way. Is this a joke? And kill the monster. Oh. I, I don't know what he's doing. Get off the stage. Do something. What do you want me to do? Anything. Get off of me, man. Dude, dude, you are stretching out ah, the whole watch it. Indian birds, Indian Ow. birds, who pitches? Ow! Lift both your legs, man. Lumberjack, save me! Ow! It's my, it's my Bethany. What's the matter? All tuckered out? Yeah. Dude, can this wait, man? My head is like killing me this morning. My fist is going to be killing you. You ruined my breakfast. You ruined everything, man. I really liked her. Well, she doesn't like you. Hey, Bethany. Bethany! Hello? What are you doing here? I got reassigned. I'm doing a story on Bethany now. Please. Why didn't you answer my text? I don't know. What's going on? Nothing. Just tell me. What do you want me to say, Gerald? Tucker told me that he saw you kissing another guy. Is that true? Maybe. Maybe? It's true. He learns that she dates all the boys, and he feels less important. Okay. That's all I needed to hear.
Look out! No trouble at all. <laughs> um, hey, do you want to go some ice cream? Yeah, yeah, I, I'd like that. Cool. Um, but first I, I need to do something. Okay. Okay. Just hey, Tucker. I just wanted to apologize about earlier. Wait, what? What's all that noise? What's wrong? Tucker! 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 Hey, wait here. Last night I got like way drunk and I think I I think I left the gate open at the monster refuge. a lot of sense. Anyway, I, I, I'm, I'm just sorry. It's all good. Things will work themselves out. Thank you. 